Shalom, shalom, Israel. It's your brother, Mikael. Of course, I'd like to give all praise to the Most High Elohim, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Don't mind the beard. I'm in my crazy mode today. But uh, I had a little report for y'all. Y'all know um, the debate scene has been jumping lately. Uh, those that follow me know I haven't really did a debate probably in about two years, I think. Maybe a year and a half, two years. I had kind of left that scene alone. It was getting old. You know, I'd rather just sit back and watch it. But uh, lately, it's been a, a lot of calls back for me to step in the ring. And I think I've matured now. Um, although I've never taken the L. That's not the point, because I always go in representation of the Most High. Therefore, I can't take an L, because it's not me. Um, I don't go proud. And so, uh, if y'all don't know about the brother Solar Vision, Solar Mind, rather, he got the new channel Solar Vision from Inner Black Media. Uh, check that out. He has a debate league going on with some fine debaters, man. I know a lot of them. I know most of them, um, or at least I uh, know of them. And um, it's going to be nice. So I've joined the debate team over at Solar Vision. Uh, haven't picked an opponent yet for me to go against first. But uh, also, Debate Talk for You, new season about to start. Shout out to Sal Showtime. Basically, where I got my first recognition as a debater on that platform. Um, so, shout out. I'll go over there and support Debate Talk for You. And also, uh, it's one more. Oh, forgive me, y'all, if I don't remember. But it, it'll come back to me. And so, yeah, as y'all can see, um, uh, Dr. Michael Brown, Dr. Michael Brown, I will be debating him. He's a, uh, he's a professor, and um, he has his doctrines, I believe, in uh, Near Eastern, uh, Near Eastern culture, if I'm a uh, saying it wrong you know my bad and uh, I believe he's uh I believe he's a uh, I believe he's also learned in um, Hebrew prior linguistics more than likely I think specifically uh, Hebrew ancient or modern I'm not sure I didn't ask all that but the, the man is a professor uh, dr. Michael Brown um, I was reached out to by his constituents and uh, said that he was interested in debating me or having a discourse with me, a discussion. Um, and I accepted. I went and I viewed his uh, first. Let me say how I went. Uh, one of my, one of my uh, brothers from the walls of Jericho. Uh, shout out to you, bro. Um, hit me up in the inbox and said, "Hey, bro, you know, hey, Ock, have you seen this?" And I said, "What?" And it was a comment left under my video. Uh, I think it was the video. Oh, it was one of the more recent videos I did. Um, I don't think it was the Bocab Malone video. I think it was. Uh, ah, anyway, if you go look on my page, it's one of, one of those videos. And in the video, he uh, basically had uh, threw out the challenge and said that uh, Dr. Michael Brown had made. Uh, a challenge out there to Hebrew Israelites to basically come to his show and defend, I guess, the their stance that we are the true Jews or Israelites and a few other things. And so I went and I watched his video. It was on Facebook Live. It was called Jewish something. Oh, and he's Jewish. So, you know, this is really going to be fun. Uh, and, you know, I'm, I listened to it and I listened to the... the the, I listened to the stance that the doctor had and it's one I've heard you know real familiar with dealing with the urban apologist and um but the funny thing about it is I don't think he knows but he named even Harry Rosenberg whom I don't think he knows I've had a I had a slight debate with I wouldn't quite call it a debate but it was more like a size up pre-debate and we were supposed to debate but as y'all know how it's become common with me uh, like the bigger name people those who have like a lot to lose as far as recognition seem to always fold the tent when it's time to debate me and uh, this was right before he debated Polite so it was on global media on Bossem channel y'all can go back and look for it 
but uh, it was right before uh, Harry.